Hello and welcome back to Come Geeksome. If you are new to the channel, please like and subscribe for all future content. Ladies and gentlemen, do we have a doozy of a story today? It has been reported by a great many of fellow anime YouTubers along and on Twitter, but today's one, it's a little bit special. And it comes from Spirit Jr. going to AN19 in five days. So go and follow him at official underscore GHJTV. This is where I got the majority of the information from. So what has happened? Bloody Jamie Marshy, she posted this yesterday. And it's mostly about the actual convention she was at. And supposedly she took great pleasure in throwing someone out of a convention just because they asked a question about I Stand With Vic. That is all. So, Jamie Marshy, she put this out. That feeling when someone travels hundreds of miles to try and call you out in public, only to get their ass handed to them. Laughed out of the room. Kicked out of the con. And then you find out it was their birthday. Ha ha. You know, tee thoughts, birthday wishes. And with all of this, it's like, whoa, what the hell's happened like, you know? Because a lot of people... They were looking and for saying, like, well, where's all this evidence? You know, you're saying this has happened, but we haven't seen anything going on. And same with Monica Real. Supposedly, someone uh, went and asked her a question, and they got laughed out of a con or something as well. But this guy, you know, the Spirit Junior, they were there. They're the ones who actually got involved, and they asked a question and everything else. So this is what he, what they've said. This is what the Q&A panel looks like in Anime North 2019 with that Jamie Marshy. Everyone was into her story and they got hypnotised and Kick Vic is going to be screwed once the truth comes out. Hashtag I stand with Vic. And I'm not going to play the video. I will let's say go and watch the video over on his or their YouTube channel and sorry and uh, their Twitter. It'll be there. You can give it a watch. But... I do advise trying turning it up as loud as you can. That's why I'm not really playing it now because I tried uh, inserting it into the video and I tried boosting the, the audio, but it just wasn't working. And for some reason, my dog is going nuts. Ah, well. So, the Legend of Spirit Jr. begins. Plus, the woman got a nerve to say, I'll never had sex. For someone that said she was by a VA, saying something like that is something to get frowned upon. I stand with Vic. Hashtag kick Vic. And in the video, it has got someone just asking a plain question. There's nothing malicious about it. There's no in serious and in intense questioning going on, as they've all said. It's just someone asking a question. And she basically said, I don't want to speak to you. Get out. And obviously, security will go, oh, here we go. Yes, we're picking ad. We're going to throw someone out. So that's what's happened there. But... Again, you know, when you had Monica Real and all these people going on saying, someone done it to me, someone done it to me. And I just want to let people know, I've said this so many times, and a lot of other people have as well. If you see them at conventions or anything, don't go up and say anything to them. There's no point, because they will try and use that and thrust that into their agenda, saying that, all the people who are following Vic, look at them. They're harassing us at conventions. They're doing this, they're doing that. We don't want to be like them, okay? I don't condone this, so there's no need going up to any of them and speaking to any of them, because they will try and use it against you. So, if you want to go and get an autograph, but I, so I doubt you would, you know, but go and do that. Or if you want to go and listen to one of their speeches, at one of the, you know, one of their talks or whatever, go ahead. Just don't say anything about the situation because they will throw you out and they will take great pleasure in it. And they will, like they have been, that photo of her where she's saying about the feeling when someone travels hundreds of miles, the actual comments in that thread, oh my god. It's just like, wow, all you people really are dumb. And I took one out of it and... This was probably the best one I actually thought from Jamie herself as well, is what the entire thing is. The gold have thrust your, your imagined slight onto an entire group of people and ruined their day because you just have to have your way no matter what. I guess narcissists and sociopaths stick together. I, I'm just like, what? 
like, how can you call people that? Because that is exactly what you are. You are exactly that, Jamie Marshy. You are exactly that, Monica Real. A narcissist who is a person who has excessive interest in or admiration of themselves. This is what you lot are. DC Douglas is exactly the same. DC Douglas is being an absolute tool at the moment because what is he doing? He's getting everything flagged on YouTube or whatever of when he's in the woman's bathroom and he is there and he's like, oh, I'm in the woman's bathroom. I didn't know. But, well, you wouldn't know if you're in a woman's bathroom, DC, because there's no urinals. It's all stalls. That's the image that you It's like, what the hell are you doing? Plus, the sign on the door says woman, not man. It's... These people on the kick of Vic's side, man, they will literally do everything in their power to make you try and feel bad about yourself. They will kick you while you're down and they will make you try and believe that you are some stupid, messed up individual. But you're not. This is, what, this is what these narcissists and sociopaths do. They will try and belittle you in front of everyone, which is what Jamie Marshy done. Because the gentleman, you know, official GHJTV, he has gone in one of the comments, someone has asked him, well, why did you go there to start shit? And he went, no, I never. I just asked the question. Which is fair enough. You know, ask a question, however. If it was about Kick Vic, probably not a good idea. But Jamie Marshy took the mick out of him because he has a uh, speech impediment. How fucked up is that of Jamie Marshy to go and make fun of someone who has a speech impediment? That, again, that just goes to show how much a bunch of fucking children these people are. And they are a bunch of narcissists and sociopaths. And when they go along and say, nope, we are fine, you know, how dare they do this? It's like, that is exactly what you are. It's, you know, it's when they go along and they're talking about that. They are a sociopath. You know, it's a, ter- it's a, you know, a sociopath is a term used to describe someone who has antisocial personality disorder. People with that, you know, they can't understand others' feelings, which is exactly what Jimmy Marshy and Monica Real are to a degree. These are what these people are. You know, they are manipulative and conning. They're pathologically lying, and you know, they literally have no shallow emotions, and they need for stimulation, which is her always having coffee or whatever. It's when you see people like this in the general public or at conventions or whatever, my advice would be just leave them alone. Is if you want to, is if you want to, it's up to you. But try and be smart about it. Don't go along and if they say anything, you know, which they will, to try and roll you up. Don't bite back because they will try and do anything in their power to make you look bad and have you thrown out of a con. That's what will happen. Speaking of being thrown out of a con, though, this actually goes back to uh, a couple of weeks ago when, obviously, there was a bit of fake news going around with saying that Monica had someone thrown out of a convention. Well, it's happened. Jamie Marsh is that person who's had someone thrown out of a convention just because they asked a question. If you're not on their opinion, uh, mind and brainwave and length, don't go to them because, like I said, they will literally try and make you feel as little as you can be and they will try and manipulate you into thinking that there's something wrong. But there's not, people. You're all brilliant and that is it. If you are new to the channel, please like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell for future updates and I'll see you soon.